Good morning from Borneo, Malaysia. In this video, I will be bringing you around uh, northern Borneo or Sabah. Uh, Malaysia is country number 94 and I'm really, really excited to bring you along. If you don't know, uh, Borneo is the third largest island in the world and it is shared by three countries, Malaysia, Indonesia and Brunei. Uh, but we are going to be exploring the Malaysian part and uh, Borneo is famous for the orangutans, the rainforest, the sea life and so much more. Uh, but before we get out there, remember to like this video and subscribe. There are new travel videos every week and I really appreciate your support. But for now, let's explore Borneo. <laughs> driven for about 40 minutes out of Kuta Kinabalu and we had made it to the Batang Penang uh, suspension bridge and uh, yeah before we were crossing the bridge we got to see a traditional uh, performance with some traditional music and dancing and yeah we're lucky with the weather it has been uh, flooding uh, for the past uh, few weeks here uh, but today it's beautiful sunshine which is a great start to this uh, adventure trip uh, and yeah now we're crossing the river on this suspension bridge uh, surrounded by a uh, very green lush uh, rainforest crocodile <laughs> No, it's not a crocodile. the foot of Mount Kinabalu. After the suspension bridge we um, went to a lookout point where we got a really nice view over the mountain. Unfortunately when we got there we found out that there was a traffic jam, <laughs> a truck blocking the road so we were stuck in traffic for a while. Uh, we have ended up in a local village where we've been shown around and then we've stopped off at one of the locals houses for lunch it was really really delicious very fresh and lots of uh, very yummy vegetables and then we also got to try the local dessert which is like steamed banana cake uh, which was really nice now it's starting to rain but we're heading to the botanical gardens to explore there before heading to the lodge for this evening the accommodation for tonight up here in the uh, mountains it's kind of like a mountain lodge resort um, and uh, yes after some unfortunate events today we didn't get to the botanical gardens because one of the cars kind of <laughs> broke down the other one got uh, stuck in the mud so um, yeah, but we made it to uh, the war memorials instead in Kundasang, which is the town where we're staying in tonight. And um, yeah, it was really interesting. I didn't know about the uh, the happenings of the uh, Sandakan Walk, uh, where um, British and Australian soldiers uh, were taken on this kind of torture walk by Japanese uh, forces and uh, yeah so it was really interesting to learn about that and uh, also in the town there was a market going on so it was quite lively uh, however we have been quite unfortunate with a lot of rain today so fingers crossed that it will get better tomorrow uh, because we're heading to uh, the river um, of uh, Kinabatagan where we are doing a lot of like boat safaris so fingers crossed that the weather will be better <laughs> for that.
have spent uh, most of the morning in a car. <laughs> As you could see in the morning, we saw a beautiful sunrise over uh, Mount Kinabalu from the lodge that we were staying. It was spectacular, clear skies. Then we got in the cars um, and we did a few stops along the way. Um, but the most profound thing by when driving here, uh, thinking that we've been driving for hours upon hours, is that all along this way we've been seeing palm oil plantations. Um, and yeah, it is uh, Saba and Malaysia's biggest industry and um, it is taking over the rainforest and has caused a lot of the uh, rainforest to disappear. Um, it is a livelihood, but it's still very sad to see how uh, yeah, the ecosystem is affected by that. And then we got to the river, jumped on a boat and got to our resort, which we'll be spending two nights at. And the resort that we're staying in tonight is called Billet. And uh, yeah, we're staying in these uh, small cabins, uh, which are raised up and yeah actually the standard is very good um, however <laughs> there are a lot of mosquitoes and bugs here so yeah we're going to try and cover up and now we're about to head on a afternoon river cruise uh, to try and see some wildlife we did spot a monkey when driving here so that was kind of the first wildlife but we hope to see much more during these days here A new place, a new home, for a while, let me feel alive Nothing to hold me back, take my time, just enjoy the ride A new man, passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt Get me up, so in new, so where I can find myself And then something pretty amazing happened. We spotted an orangutan and a baby wow. orangutan in the trees. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's amazing. And this was such a unique experience, seeing them in their natural habitat in the wild. As you may know, orangutans are an endangered species and there are not a lot left. And because of the deforestation that is happening on Borneo, there are not a lot left. However, I feel so lucky and grateful to be able to have seen them in the wild. Okay, so we have just got back from the first uh, river cruise and we were so 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 lucky because within five minutes we saw an orangutan and a baby orangutan and we got super close and they were you know hanging around in the trees and it was so amazing because it was one of the things that you know really really uh, inspired me to come to Borneo and a lot of the orangutans are dying out so yeah, that was a really really cool experience and so grateful and feel so lucky that we did see them. Good morning, so it's currently 6.30 uh, and we have woken up to this beautiful sunrise that is happening behind me and uh, yeah this misty morning we are heading out on a morning cruise to try and see some more wildlife so um yeah let's go and then we have a monkey that is getting very close
Okay, so we are now back after two um, boats of forest today. Um, so we did the first one in the morning and you saw the beautiful sunrise over the uh, river, which was really, really beautiful. And um, yeah, then we came back for lunch and then had a very chill day, relaxing mostly at the lodge here. Uh, we had lunch and then we went out on the afternoon cruise again. Uh, another thing you need to encourage and uh, this is lesson rich soup and uh, then now we're just heading to uh, dinner and maybe going on a night cruise um, which will be the, the last part of this uh, time here in um, Kinabatagan River what if your dreams are making it hard to think straight? If you still love me, I can wait, I can wait And remember this We could have been stardust Same world but without us Something made us, made us find each other out there Made us realize we're more than just stardust Ignore this fact if you must To do what your dreams are telling you to do And I'll be out there looking for someone like you video part one uh, so I will close it off here and continue tomorrow for part two uh, which will bring you along to more places in Borneo. Uh, I hope that you have enjoyed following along and remember to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye!